Hello, my name is Anthony. Welcome to the session that discusses the changes to the application toolbar, which is available in 24C in the Oracle Utilities Cloud Services. In this session, we'll talk about this new feature and how it can impact your business. I will give you an overview of the changes to the application toolbar, followed by more detail to explain how to use it and the benefits to your business. We'll then walk you through a demonstration. We have introduced a new format for the application toolbar as part of this release for all cloud customers. This is a mandatory change as it forms the foundation for further changes as part of our commitment to Redwood. There is no opt-out option for this enhancement. We have introduced changes to improve efficiency in several ways. Reducing screen real estate used by the application toolbar to release more for your content. Logically consolidate and group content to improve visibility and usability. Improve the efficiency of the toolbar and improve the consistency with the existing browser practices. And this is a part of the ongoing transition to the Redwood standards as most of these changes conform to that standard. In this release, we have introduced a new thinner and consolidate header to release some real estate back for your content to drive efficiency and towards the Redwood standard. You can see an example on this slide. The changes include the header, which is now thinner. This releases lines back to be used for your portal zone content. Various menus are now consolidated into a single menu, mirroring the Redwood standards. We will discuss the menus separately in the demonstration as those have also changed. Navigation mirrors a typical browser with forward and back arrows. Holding the arrows will display your history just like the browser does. Identity of the product and service with your domain, if the domain name is configured, is now shown. Icons are now used in the standard way. For some products, you might see other icons for quick navigation. The sidebar is now a panel with a dedicated close and open icon on the application toolbar. And additionally, the toolbar will react to resolution changes more appropriately, only hiding content when necessary. Now let's take a look at the application toolbar changes. Welcome to the demonstration of the application toolbar changes. As you can see, the new toolbar is at the top of the screen. With the new changes, as you can see, it's thinner and more concise and more optimized. So let's go through the optimizations from left to right. First icon is the menu icon. The menu icon shows a consolidated menu now using the Redwood standards. So you can see the main menu and admin menu, which used to be separate menus and now one set of menus consolidated. Favorite links and bookmarks if configured are also shown on this main menu now. So to use the menu, simply click on the menu item you wish to see. The arrow here indicates that the there is more information or there's a sub menu. And basically you navigate to where you want to go. So for example, I want to go to tools. And you can see here that you have the menu item. Now in the past, the menu items had two entries, one for the search and one for the add when, when you had two functions. In this release, one item covers both. So when you click on the item, you get the search. When you click on the add button, you get the add function. Now the major difference apart from the look and feel of the menu is the fact that the menu now is persistent across the session. For example, as I navigate away from the menu, in the old release, if you wanted to go back to the menu, you had to go from the top and navigate down again. Now simply clicking the menu item will take you back to where you were before. This will reset back to the main menu when you get out of the session. You can alternatively navigate back using the back button. It's back to the main menu again. This we have found is more efficient than the way it used to be. Now that's the menu. The next set of buttons are navigation buttons. In the past release, there was three. There was 
back, forward, and history. Now, in most modern browsers, you now get a back and forward button only. And you hold the back or forward button to get the history, which is a far more consistent with the browser. So now in this release, we, we will show. Now, if you have no history, they are grayed out, just so you know. So in this case, I've showed you they've both got data in them. Okay. The next thing is the consolidated identity. So your product or service is now listed as well as the domain name if it is configured. In this case, this is Oracle Utilities Customer Care and Billing. And, it, and this is the domain name is marked as demo and the release number. Now the next section of the toolbar will vary according to your product or service. In this case, this is customer care and billing, as well as CCS, as well as CCBCS and RCS. And BCS has extra buttons here. Let's show quick navigations. Okay. These will not appear in some products. Just be aware. In this demo, I'm using this environment to show you that these are extra buttons. Now, the, the unified search is still the same and works still as operated, but it's been uh, optimized, the size of it, as well as the um, features to suit this new toolbar. So you can see it's thinner and it's a lot more easier on the eye. The last section is probably the most uh, changed section. So now the home button is way over here. Again, this mirrors what uh, browsers do. They put the home button away from the other, from the left rather than the right. The next icon is the toolbar or the sidebar, which is this section of the screen. It's now a panel, as you can see, a panel that goes all the way up. You can still resize it just as you did before. But this icon allows you to hide it and unhide it as you need be. Now, please note, the icon may look different depending which side of the screen your sidebar is on. Now, the help menu has been consolidated a little bit, very slightly in this release. And again, the menu items will depend on your profile. And of course, you've got the avatar. So this is the changes to the application toolbar. And as you can see, it's far more consolidated and gives you more space for your content in your zones. This concludes this presentation. Thank you for watching.